Peter College Grade 3 Mathematics Hello children, how are you all? Hope you all are doing well. Today, we are going to do a new lesson. We'll see what's the lesson we are going to do today. First of all, let's see what's the wall today. Today, we are going to learn Unit 8, Geometrical Shapes. This lesson helps you to gain an understanding of the flat shapes and solids. To improve the drawing skill and recognizing the shapes and examples for each shape. And to identify the properties of geometrical shapes correctly. Can you see some friends? What are we going to learn? We are going to learn about geometrical shapes. We'll see what are the shapes we are going to learn today. Circle, rectangle, triangle, square. Properties of geometrical shapes. What do you mean by properties, children? Properties means a thing or things belonging to someone or something. We'll see the lesson. First, we'll take the shape of square. Do you all know that there are four sides in the square? We'll count one, two, three, four. How many sides are there? There are four sides. And how many corners? There are four corners. One, two, three, four. And another special thing is all the sides are equal. See, all the sides are equal, right? Our next shape is rectangle. Do you all know how to do a rectangle? Yeah, you already learned it. We'll see how many sides are there, how many corners are there, like that, okay? There are four sides. How many sides? There are four sides. We'll count. One, two, three, four. There are four sides. And how many corners are there? It has four corners. Let's count together. One, two, three, four. How many corners? It has four corners. And you learned in the square all the sides are same or equal but in rectangle opposite sides are equal can you see the yellow lines and black lines these are the opposite sides so we can say opposite sides are equal in rectangle okay look at this shape what is the name of the shape it's a triangle how many sides are there in the triangle? There are three sides. So we can say it has three sides. Let's count together. One, two, three. How many sides? There are three sides. And how many corners are there? How many corners? Same. There are three corners. Right? Let's count. One, two, three. Three. Then we can say it has three sides and it has three corners. Right? What is the next shape? It's a circle. Right? What is the shape of the circle? We can say it is round in shape. Can you see any sides in the circle? No. 
we can't see any sides in the circle so we can say it has no straight sides it has no straight sides about the circle what are the things we can say then it is round and it has no straight sides right now teacher wants to check whether you all can write the names of the shapes correctly i hope that you all have the personal whiteboard with you let's quickly take it out now teacher is going to tell the name of the shape you all have to write it in your personal whiteboard first write the word circle then square and next rectangle and the last one is triangle right so you all can check your answers by yourself okay children on the geometrical shapes there's another part we have to learn do you all know these friends say hello to them okay who are those they are solid shapes they are solid shapes cube do you know what is the name of this solid it's a cube and look at this what is the name of this solid it's a cuboid and this is a cylinder just like a circle what is that it's a sphere and i told you that i have a new friend for you to introduce now you see that's a tetrahedron what's that tetrahedron again tetrahedron right that is the new friend now we are going to learn about those first we we'll learn about the cube do you all know how to draw the cube as i think yes okay we'll see how many plane faces are there in a cube there are six plane faces we'll count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 it has six plane faces then we can say all the faces are square in shape can you see all the faces are square in shape and equal in size right all the faces are square in shape and equal in size what are the examples we can take to the cube do you all know the dice yes you can see the picture of a dice and another picture rubik cube that's a rubik cube so what are the examples we can take for cube dice and rubik cube this is a cuboid do you all know how to draw a cuboid yes you learned when you were in grade 2 look it has six plane faces we'll count together 1 2 3 4 5 6 how many plane faces are there there are six plane faces and opposite faces are equal in size and shape look the opposite faces the opposite faces are equal in size and shape right what are the examples we can take for cuboid brick and toothpaste box brick and toothpaste box our next solid is cylinder what can we say about the cylinder it has two plane faces up face and down face right it has two plane faces and it has one curved face 
how many curved faces are there there is only one curved face and it has two curved edges how many curved edges it has there is only two curved edges and it has no straight edges or corners we can't find any straight edges or corners in cylinder what are the examples for cylinder we can take the salmon tin and barrel those are the examples for cylinder sphere what is the next one sphere it is a round solid that means it is round in shape not like a circle actually fine it does not have any straight edges or plain faces can you see any plain faces here no right it has a round surface it has a round surface and it is a round in shape this is about the sphere what are the examples for the sphere ball and the earth they are getting like the shape of the sphere so what are the examples ball and the earth tetrahedron that's the new friend we'll see what are the properties it has four flat faces it has four flat faces and all the faces are triangles all the faces are triangle in shape right what are the examples we can take for the tetrahedron magic cube can you see a picture of a magic cube yes that's the example for tetrahedron and gift boxes magic cube and gift boxes then we'll talk about properties of solid shapes properties of solid shapes we talked about properties of shapes and here we are talking about properties of solid shapes can you see a picture of a cube yes here you have to learn some new words right first one is vertex vertex means corner okay vertex mean corner and edge edge means side edge means side and face you already know right vertex edge and face cube how many edges are there in a cube there are 12 edges we'll count together 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 64 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 72 73 74 75 76 77 78 79 80 81 82 83 84 85 86 87 88 89 90 how many edges are there in a cube there are 12 edges how many faces are there in a cube there are six faces there are six faces 1 2 3 4 5 6 and how many vertices are there how many corners are there there are eight vertices look 1 2 3 4 5 6 Seven, eight. How many corners or how many vertices? There are eight vertices, right? Cuboid. 
how many edges are there in a cuboid? Twelve. There are twelve edges are in the cuboid. We'll count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There are twelve edges in a cuboid. And how many faces are there in the cuboid? There are six faces. We'll count one, two, three, four, five, six. And how many vertices are there in a cuboid? There are eight vertices. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How many vertices? There are eight vertices. Cylinder. In the cylinder, how many edges are there? There are two edges. Look, one, two, up part and the down part, right? And how many plane faces are there? There are two plane faces. And how many curved faces are there? There's only one curved face. Can you see any vertices there? No. There are no vertices we can see in the cylinder. Right? Sphere. How many edges are there in the sphere? None. Zero. We can't find any edges in the sphere. And how many curved faces in the sphere? There's only one curved face. There's only one curved face. Can you see any vertices? Or in another way we say corners? No, we can't find any vertices in the sphere. Then none. Right? Tetrahedron. This is about the tetrahedron. How many edges are there in the tetrahedron? There are six edges. We'll count. One, two, three, four, five, six. And how many faces are there? There are four faces. We'll count. One, two, three, four. And how many vertices? How many corners are there? There are four corners as well. See? One, two, three, four. There are four corners. There are four corners. In another way, we can say vertices. Right? We have come to the end of today's lesson. Hope you all got an idea about geometrical shapes. We'll meet in another lesson next day. Until then, stay safe my children. Goodbye.